Relock Chapter 18 Sententiae Antiquae. Posunt quia posse videntur. Posunt, they are able, that's your main verb right there. Since, hmm, videntur, enter ending there, that's passive, they seem to be able. And this here isn't your infinitive, present active infinitive, videntur, passive. It's 3P, and it's present. Yep. Let's take a look at another. Et diam fortes viris subitis pericolis saipe talentur. All right, verb at the end. There it is. It's going to be passive. Enter. That's going to be 3P. It's going to be present. All right, we're looking for a plural subject because we have a plural verb. Ooh, big S here, fortes weary. Brave men, brave men are terrified. Even, oh, okay, even brave men are terrified. Saipe, often. And then let's take a look at this. I'm calling this ablative plural. Hmm. See a passive verb form? Look for the ablative. They are terrified by sudden dangers. Even brave men are terrified by sudden dangers often. All right. Three. Tua concilia sunt clara nobis. All right, let's stop right there because we have a semicolon. Your plans are clear. And nobis, you got a choice of dative or ablative there. I'm going to go with the dative to us. That makes sense. Not by us. Teneris scantia horum kiwium omnium. Now there is a similar sound going on in here. Horum kiwium omnium. This is genitive plural all the way along here. Of all these citizens. All right, let's see what else is going on here. Teneris scantia. Well, Scantia is a noun, and with the macron over the A, that's ablative. All right, so that's got to leave that as the verb. Looks pretty funny, but our ris tour, so that's you. That's second person singular. Two S, it's passive, because it's got the passive ending, it's present. So this is you are being held in check by the knowledge of all these citizens. Malam est concilium, quod mutari non potest. Okay, I see a verb here. I see a verb here. Now, quod, this is a relative pronoun. It means which. Haven't taught you that yet. That's in chapter... 17, I believe. Um, bad is a plan. All right, kind of makes sense. Bad is a plan which is not able to be changed. So Mutari, present, passive, infinitive. Yeah. Protest always takes uh, a complementary infinitive. On its own, it doesn't really mean much. Potest, he is able. He's able to what? You know? Nihil igitur mors est, quoniam natura animi habetur mortalis. Now, there's two verbs in here. So we've got to find some kind of joiner. This quoniam, look in the note there, that means since. So that's kind of a splitter there. Since, and S, we're looking for a singular subject. There it is, Moore's. Death is therefore nothing. Since, all right, so singular verb, singular subject. There it is, natura, that's nominative, singular. Feminine, right? So that's your subject. The nature of the mind 
is being considered, or let's just say is considered mortal. This is a predicate modifier. Because you wouldn't say uh, a mortal mind, a mortal nature is considered. You'd say the nature is considered mortal. So that predicates it. A little bit different. Uh, nice, interesting philosophy. This is from Lucretius, who talks a lot about mortality.